Well, this is another little activity that you could use for individual or possibly a whole class if you had the equipment to, to view it. And all it is is a little bit of music. We're looking at Peter and the Wolf. So you could read the story out or the um, student could be reading the story. And at certain places, I've got these little dots again. So if the student was reading it, early one morning, Peter opened the gate and walked out into the big green meadow. And we tap on the dot. And we hear the musical theme for the character. And they can go through that uh, passage or the story. As you can see, I've got little dots different in different places. And, for example, the last one, the big grey wolf came out of the forest. And so they have this sheet that they can reread or listen to the characters and you might design a question sheet for them and so that they have to tap on the dot and they have to determine which character the theme is representing and which instrument or family is being used to play the character so if we go down to here and we tap on our first dot here and listen to it And they may recognise that straight away, that that represents the duck. And the instrument playing that is the oboe. If not, they can go back to the story. You may have done some uh, uh, previous work with the uh, character themes and the instruments. But you can also use a little uh, pen application called the piano which you may be able to bring into it to if you've got an activity looking at different uh, instruments, different notes, scales, etc. So I'll see if we can get this to work. Main menu, paper replay, piano. Okay. Draw your piano. First, draw nine vertical lines from left to right. So we just follow the instructions. Right, and now our, pi the keys to play. our piano should be right. So if I pick an instrument. Vibraphone. So on. Uh, rhythm. If you want to look at that, you can change that by tapping on it. You can change the instrument. And then to stop that, we can just click the stop button. So, music teacher may be able to incorporate this into a, a little uh, exercise for an individual student or for class participation.